Okay, we're going to do a quick um, look at the combined gas law. All right, so this is, here's the question. Combined gas law, just to review, is uh, P1V1 over T1 is equal to P2V2 over T2. All right, so here's the question. A gas at 2.5 atmospheres and 25 degrees Celsius expands to five, 750 milliliters after being cooled to zero degrees Celsius and depressurized, in other words, the pressure has been lowered, to 122 kilopascals. What was the original volume of the gas? All right, so with any uh, question dealing with a change in conditions, a gas starting at some initial condition and ending up at some uh, different condition, or vice versa, some gas at some final condition, and we want to know something about the original condition, you use the combined gas law, where pressure and volume and temperature are related, okay? So the thing you want to do always is uh, sort out all your variables, all right? So here we list what was the initial pressure. It was 2.5 atmospheres. What was the initial temperature? It was 25 degrees Celsius. You always convert into Kelvin and you add 273 to convert into Kelvin. So you plus 273 to whatever Celsius temperature there is, all right? So continuing on with our variables, what was the volume at the end? It was 750 milliliters. And what was the final temperature? It was zero Celsius, or 273 Kelvin. Again, remember, convert into Kelvin by adding 273. The final pressure was 122 kilopascals. We need to convert this into atmospheres. Everything has to be in units of atmosphere. So how do you convert kilopascals to atmospheres? You divide by 101.3. That is, take 122 kilopascals and divide it by 101.3. That converts it into atmospheres, all right? We're looking for the initial volume, all right? So here's our equation right here. And we're going to substitute in P1 from right here and V1, which we're looking for. And then we plug in T1 on the bottom right here. All right. Then take P2, which is right here, 1.2 atmospheres. Multiply it by V2 right here, which was 750 milliliters, and divide by T2. T2 is right here, 273 Kelvin. All right, plug that all in, you should get 390 millimeters.